Since its mysterious beginnings, the universe has expanded at an ever-accelerating pace, leaving us to marvel at its vastness and complexity. The estimations of cosmologists suggest that photons, the oldest known remnants of the Big Bang, have traveled a distance of 47 billion light-years to reach us. This implies that the observable universe spans 93 billion light-years, give or take a few light-years. Such a vast expanse houses an array of celestial phenomena, including quarks, quasars, stars, planets, nebulae, black holes, and all other detectable entities. Nonetheless, this vast universe encompasses only the light that has been able to make its way to us, leaving us to ponder the unknown beyond the observable horizon. How can we even fathom that the universe spans 93 billion light years if it is only 13.8 billion years old? Can light travel that distance in such a relatively short amount of time? These perplexing questions and uncertainties are the very essence of physics, and delving into their intricacies is fundamental to understanding what exists beyond the observable universe and whether we can ever access it. The question of what exists beyond the universe is perplexing, as the concept of the universe itself is challenging to define. One commonly accepted theory is that of the observable universe, defined in terms of the speed of light. The observable universe is limited to the extent that the light emitted or reflected by objects within it has had time to travel to our position in space. This means that our ability to observe the universe is limited by the finite speed of light and the finite duration of the universe's existence. It is worth noting, however, that the observable universe is not a static entity, but rather constantly expanding. As such, the boundary of the observable universe is not a fixed point in space, but rather a dynamic, ever-changing frontier continually pushing outwards as more light becomes available for us to observe. This expansion is sometimes referred to as the Hubble volume in honor of the famous telescope that has provided us with some of the most distant views of the cosmos. The Hubble volume is another theory of what may exist beyond what we can observe. The current astronomical hypothesis is that the universe might extend infinitely, with an almost uniform distribution of energy, galaxies, and other celestial bodies similar to what is observable. If this theory is accurate, the implications of what lies beyond are mind-boggling. Imagine traveling beyond the Hubble volume and discovering more than just alternative planets. Eventually, you'll come across every possible thing in existence, and I mean everything. It is an idea that will leave you stunned if you try to grasp it. A more prevalent theory proposes the existence of a multiverse, with innumerable universes that exist as bubbles floating alongside one another. Each universe is unique and represents an alternative reality. Given this theory and its implications regarding infinity, it would not be unreasonable to suggest that there exists a universe that is identical to the one in which we live. Except that you are employed as a roller skating clown. Similarly, there is a universe where you were never born, and yet another where you are a serial killer. Travel far enough, and you'll encounter another solar system, where a similar Earth that mirrors every aspect of ours, except for the breakfast you had this morning, exists. Let that sink in. There may be another Earth where you skipped breakfast and another where you decided to skip work or go on a much-needed vacation. The extent of the universe is such that cosmologists predict there's an identical Hubble volume to ours out there, and it's not even that far away. It is closer than we can imagine. The mere possibility of such an occurrence seems far-fetched. But then again, infinity is undoubtedly infinite. Astronomers made an astonishing discovery that left them reeling in shock. They found out that galactic clusters were hurtling in the same direction at a breakneck pace of over 2.5 million miles an hour. But wait, it gets weirder. Further observations in 2010 cemented the reality of this theory, which we now know as dark flow. The confounding movement flies in the face of all the predictions made 
regarding mass distribution throughout the universe following the cataclysmic Big Bang. So what could be causing this shocking behavior? One possibility is the gravitational influence of gigantic structures existing beyond the Hubble volume, structures that defy our wildest imaginings. This implies that outside our observable universe, the system of the world beyond is anything but uniform. But what could these systems be made of, you ask? The answer is anything and everything. From massive clusters of matter and energy to unfathomable warps capable of pulling gravitational forces from the outside world. Intriguingly, another plausible theory regarding what lies in the unobservable domain beyond our universe is that it could be an endless, desolate expanse of absolute nothingness. On the other hand, nothingness is essentially incomprehensible to humans as we lack the cognitive capacity to fully grasp such an abstract concept. We should also know that a vast, dark space does not equate to nothingness. It is a space. The theory of supposed nothingness raises the question of whether it is even plausible for such a boundless realm to exist. Based on our current scope of understanding, everything in existence is finite. Even entities that appear to be infinite are, in actuality, merely near infinity, but never truly attain a boundless state. Discussing the elements beyond the boundaries of the Hubble volume may seem somewhat misleading, for they are still a part of the same universe we are in, maybe a fragment that is beyond what we can see or comprehend. As such, it would still adhere to the same physical laws and constants intrinsic to our universe. However, an alternative narrative of the Big Bang proposes that the universe underwent a post-Big Bang expansion that caused the formation of bubbles within the space's structure. Each of these bubbles represents a region that ceased to stretch with the rest of space and as a result, gave rise to its universe with its own unique set of physical laws. In this bubble theory, space is infinite, and each bubble is similarly boundless as an infinite number of infinities can be contained within one infinity. Even if it were possible to exceed the confines of our bubble, the interbubble expanse would still be expanding at an accelerated pace, rendering it impossible to reach the next one regardless of one's velocity. The theory of bubbles explains the existence of these universes, each of which exists as a separate bubble, disconnected from the others and floating in space. Some people speculate that it might be possible to traverse from one reality to another by passing through a wormhole or a black hole. This brings us to my favorite theory, that we may be trapped inside a black hole. If this were true, you can jump from one universe to another by entering a different black hole. Stellar remnants that come into existence from dying stars imploding under their gravity, black holes possess an extraordinary density that leads to the formation of a singularity. The space-time bent by black holes is so extreme that it engulfs everything beyond the event horizon, including light, making it a point of no return. Much like the unknown abyss behind the event horizon, the limits of our universe remain shrouded in mystery. What if our universe is, in reality, nestled inside one such black hole, expanding at an unprecedented pace, with its edges constantly pushing away beyond our grasp? Could it be the same force that restricts light from escaping a black hole that propels the universe's expansion. The gravitational pull that we observe outside a black hole is, in actuality, a result of an ever-expanding space-time on the inside, pushing the boundaries far away from everything. The expansion of our universe follows a similar trajectory. Nikodem Poplowski, a theoretical physicist hailed by Forbes magazine in 2015 as the next possible Einstein, proposed another fascinating theory. According to him, our universe is a fraction of a much larger universe that was swallowed by a black hole and squashed until it reached an unimaginable density. The gravitational spin heavily impacted the core fragment, causing it to explode violently, giving birth to our current universe through the Big Bang Theory. 
The event horizon of a black hole is described as the point where the curvature of space-time exceeds the speed of light, making it impossible for anything to escape. The same fate awaits our universe, expanding at a rate much faster than the speed of light, which results in its boundaries moving further beyond the speed of light. Hence, are we trapped inside a massive black hole? Furthermore, every black hole in our universe may have multiple universes, each similar to our own, and beyond our observable universe. A more massive universe could be waiting for us. Our universe is merely a speck confined inside a black hole. Numerous theories have proposed the existence of parallel universes. However, the most prevalently accepted one in modern times includes a transformation of the precepts of string theory to include oscillating membranes that vibrate within additional dimensions. These undulating membranes situated in the 11th dimension represent whole new universes, and when these reverberations forcefully collide with each other, they create a novel universe altogether. The reverberating motion effect helps us better understand the matter distribution in our universe. One of the theory's most bewildering elements is that all the gravitational forces we experience in our universe are seeping in from another universe, situated in a completely different dimension. This might explain why the force of gravity in our universe appears so tepid when compared with other dimensions. As the universe expands and time marches on, it reveals novel galaxies and stars whose luminosity has only recently made it to our humble planet. However, these infant cosmic bodies will eventually wane, their brightness diminishing due to the effects of redshift that lengthen the light's journey through space. Ultimately, the farthest stars and galaxies will fade into obscurity, becoming invisible to our human eyes. Interestingly, the universe does not require an external perspective to exist. It simply is, and its mathematical self-consistency allows us to define it as a three-dimensional universe without needing an outside presence. The visual imagery of a universe depicted as a sphere drifting in the vast emptiness of space is merely a mental trick. But whether it be vast nothingness, a galaxy existing beyond the confines of a black hole, or bubbles, we may never attain a definitive answer to the question of what lies beyond. We can only assume and speculate. And that's a wrap on today's video. We hope you enjoyed this video and learned something new today. And as always, keep exploring.